So we're going to go over our motion offense, which is five out that we're also going to be running. OK, so as you can see, we have five perimeter guys, maybe one power forward um, that is out there that's going to move into the center position. OK, we want to maximize all this space in here. And most of the action is going to be off of the pass and cutting hard. OK, now we need to establish something called the nail. The nail is an imaginary line that runs from right underneath the basket up to the free throw line, okay? It's just imaginary line. Just imagine a straight line from here to here. It's there so that you can know that as you pass this ball and cut through, you need to touch a piece of this imaginary line. It does not have to be the, all the way down here as long as you touch a piece of it before you cut out to rotate. Okay, so we're going to play it here. You're going to see the point guard. He's going to pass it. You could pass the ball either way. It does not matter. Then you're going to see us rotate. This is the basic motion of, of five out. Okay, point guard passes here. Then we're going to fill the holes here. There's a hole here. This guard's going to move here. This guard's going to move here. This guard's going to move there. Okay. Same action, we're gonna pass the ball, we're gonna cut through. So one thing on the cut, you need to make sure that you're cutting extremely hard. This is a hard cut. You want to take defenders' attention and have them move their body. And if they don't move their body, as soon as this pass is caught, you're looking, right? This, this guard is looking to get the ball in here, okay? So we're gonna have that same rotation. He passes, cuts through the nail, then we're gonna all rotate. Now we have a skip pass here. I would like him to be a little bit higher, but it's a skip pass nonetheless, okay? And we're gonna talk about something called stay, okay? If you hear stay, it means that these guards in the corner are staying there because they're gonna be receiving a pick off the ball. Okay, so he skip passes there. Now he's going to touch the nail. Now he's going out here to set a pick for this guard. We're still gonna fill this hole in our normal five out offense this guard would have already rotated he's gonna wait now and receive this pick okay as this pick happens remember you come off hard over here this is a good pass curl and catch here dynamic move get to the bucket curl and jump shot be aggressive coming off of this back pick here okay for our simulation here, the small forward is going to swing the ball this way. That that situation wasn't open, okay? So he's going to swing, but we're going to have the same exact um, action going on, okay? We're going to have this forward fill here, but now we're going to have this guy touching the nail and also setting this back pick here, okay? Same exact action. Okay. Things to remember, again, coming off here being aggressive, curling. A good thing that we can do here is a V cut. So you're gonna make a V here to here, right? You can flash and get out, right? Be creative here. Try to make this pass easy and accessible for this forward. Okay, then we're gonna all fill a hole and that's our five out motion.